Hello, it takes the fly carpet. Today I'm going to show you the other hand flip cast. This is a great tool for preventing your slider cart. It really works well at close range. Right now I'm standing at 15 feet to my target. It really only works out to about 20 feet. Anything beyond that, this cast just doesn't work at all. Okay? Now how it starts is with your fly in your non-casting hand or just a couple inches above the fly. Okay? You're going to have your rod slightly elevated out at a 45 degree angle. You're going to swing the fly underhand and drop it into the water. So let's take a look at how that works. Alright, I don't know if you can see the fly there, but it drops in very, very gently. That's important because this cast can be used as either a direct or an indirect presentation. So I can cast beyond the fish, do a drag and drop, drop it right on the dinner plate. Okay? Or, if for some reason I have to cast directly to the cart, maybe there's a bank in front of them, it's often one situation, or there's another, there's a pot of carp and there's carp past him, and if you cast past him and hit those carp, it's going to scare the whole pod. Sometimes you have to present directly. This is a great way to present directly. The fly drops in very gently, without a big splash, even if it's a heavy fly. Perfect 10 landing, just about every time. So let's talk about the fly for this presentation. Now, oddly enough, in every way, shape, and form, this presentation works better with a heavy fly. The heavy fly gives you more of a pendulum to swing with. It slows everything down and makes everything more predictable. It makes it easier to target exactly where you want the fly to land. Because the fly is skimming across the top of the water, you just drop it in. It lands very gently, even if the fly is really heavy. All right now, let's take a look at this on the water. A little bit. Once again, there, I was off a little bit, so I just dragged it and dropped it. When you get really good with this, and you've been using it a lot, really, you can just pop it within inches of where you want it to be from this range. You know, I'm at 15, 20 feet, something like that. So it was a little bit long, I just dragged it and dropped it, okay? Let's uh, scoot back a little bit so I'm at the right range. Bam, okay? Now that's more of a direct presentation. 